Uh, hello guys, welcome to United Gozos. I'm here with Kevin Cutter. He uh, just lost the last round today. And uh, yeah, it won is your record now. And he will go to top eight or top four, I guess. And I will show you a deck. Let's see, guys. Uh, I decided to play Snake Eye because it's the deck I felt like most comfortable with this year. Sadly, it's the last tournament with it, but uh, yeah, it worked out. So I will show you the list. Uh, 3 Belt Bellstar, Poplar, Ash, Ash, Poplar, Oak. This should be standard. Most uh, I've, I've seen many players uh, does play uh, two of him, but uh, I decided one is enough. Uh, one Did you ever miss the second one? No, I. Okay. I, I play uh, two copies of Princess, so if I have to recycle some stuff, I just summon the second. And the brick flame verge. Yeah, and I build stuff. And the other brick. But they are okay because you can pitch them off with uh, sure. deception. Sure, sure, sure. For the hand trap lineup, I play free Ash, free Purulia, and free Fuvalos. Um, in last week in Bologna, I played Purulia inside. And played super polymerization in, instead, but I felt like super poly is too bricky sometimes, and this uh, definitely uh, stops uh, the opponent from playing. Yeah, it's every good when you go second every turn. Exactly. So, uh, one called by, nothing to say, and I decided to play three talents this tournament because uh, people are running uh, or are playing now the Kashtira Fiendsmith deck and this is just the best card against that. Yeah. Did you play against the deck? Uh, yeah, I played it. I faced it once. Okay. Beat it two. Okay. Uh, okay. The popular targets. Sure. Free wanted. Yes. Standard free bonfire as well as one, one for one. I know it conflicts a lot against Dominus Impulse, but uh, I mean, one you have to play. Uh, one more starter, you need the starter though that you don't, uh, do not break. Exactly. Okay. And free deception and one hollowed. Okay. Uh, free imperm and free impulse because they are the best hand traps this format. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, did, you, uh, did you want to change anything of the uh, main deck? No, worked up. How many cards did you play? Uh, 40, 40 straight. 40. 40. Okay, so a perfect number. Exactly. Just. Consistency, uh, yeah, okay, perfect. Yeah, to the extra deck, the both Azaminas, nothing to say. Uh, Typhoon and Fucho, never summoned, okay. but I had the space. Uh, the Charmers, Hida, and Dark, nothing sure. to say. Um, Phoenix, Raging, and Zelantes for the OTK combo. Also, I summoned him in my first turn combo. Okay. So uh, the OTK came up really, uh, uh, really less. Uh, one Anima, one Mascarena, and I decided to play two SP and two Princes just because everyone is playing Unicorn and you have to uh, play both of them. Um, also, the second SP comes up really often in the mirror match. Okay. Cool. Uh, I guess extra deck is also fine. You don't extra want to deck change. is perfect. Okay. Sometimes I miss pit night early, but yeah, okay, it's okay. For the side deck, I played three ogre. I yes. thought about playing Bell since yesterday, but uh, Philip Weidinger forced me to play ogre over it because it's uh, more versatile against the uh, uh, whole format. Also, it's good against Tenpai. Um, since it's since it was a regional and everyone is playing Kashtira Finsmith now, um, I've seen the decklists of Nico Schlierkamp last week and they are running Solemn, so you have to get rid of them. So I played like the whole uh, deck removal stuff. Okay, perfect, yes. Uh, worked out pretty well. Um, the floodgates if you go first. Sure. And free heat wave against uh, stuff like uh, Tenpai to uh, for uh, to dodge Shifter or Porulia worked out in Bologna as great as today. Um, wouldn't regret it to play. It. Perfect. What was your matchup today? Tell me. Uh, I played only variant stuff like 210 by Melodious 
I don't remember. Uh, uh, tier everything was. Uh, <laughs> I faced everything. Yeah. yeah. And you lost against Tempo Rex. I lost against Simon E with Tempo last round. Okay. Yeah. Okay, guys. Uh, thank you. Shout out. Kevin, any shout outs? Yeah, shout outs to the team, United Gozos, as always. Shout out to Yusuf Kutsunkaya, as always, who uh, gave me a stack for this uh, tournament. And yeah, that's it, basically. Thank you.